to our next session. Here, I would like to invite Mr. Rohit Dosi, Director, Microsoft Advertising in Mobi. Mr. Dosi is responsible for PNL management, revenue growth, strategic partnerships for Microsoft advertising business in India. Prior to InMobi, he has worked with the likes of Google and Rocket Internet. In his entrepreneurial journey, he co-founded Latahu, a B2B hyperlocal logistics startup. He's a graduate of IIT Rurki and loves spending his free time with his pet dog. Now, Rohit will be unveiling Microsoft Advertising's latest Search in India 2021 report and share some interesting insights on the evolving search trends across verticals and what it means for brands. So I welcome uh, Rohit, you here on screen and to our eTech Munch platform and looking forward to the report unveiling. Okay, perfect, perfect. Hi everyone. Uh, first of all, thank you uh, for the warm introduction. Uh, I think for everyone who has joined on call, hope you're doing well and, and you and your loved ones are safe. I know that times have been tough, uh, but I think it is also important for us to, to remain positive and I'm sure we'll come out of this stronger together. I think moving to why we are all here, I think I wanted to take this opportunity to unveil our latest report on search trends in India in 2021 uh, on Microsoft search advertising. Search still continues to, to dominate a major share of digital advertising spends. And, and with the ongoing pandemic, search advertising continued to be an area of investment for brands in different verticals. Uh, in this report, I'll be sharing user behavior and insights uh, that we see on Microsoft Search, I think a lot has happened and, and a lot has changed, right? And there is no denying that uh, we have seen a lot of digital disruption and development in technology that has happened in the last 12 to 18 months. And, um, and on Microsoft Search too, we saw that there were certainly like a lot of categories, newer categories, newer niche verticals, which saw quite a boost in the number of users uh, searching for brands in different categories. Diving into um, specific insights that we've seen on Microsoft Search now, uh, we've seen a humongous uh, increase in location specific search queries, which is uh, specific to things in vicinity around people and the requirements and the services they use. Uh, we have also seen a lot of, uh, you know, increase in queries for content translation to local languages. I think the latter one is really interesting because this in some way, right, also indicates that there are a lot of new users or users from tier two, tier three and small towns now coming online and searching for a lot of things. Jumping uh, now into the vertical specific trends that we are seeing on Microsoft search. Uh, there has been a huge spike in focus on hyperlocal services since last year. I think when we first went into lockdown, search queries had a lot of uh, I mean, the term near me, right, present in them as users were looking for several things around them with lockdown and pandemic, whether it could be grocery shops, uh, doctors, stationery shops, hardware shops, etc. What we're now seeing is that this vertical continues to grow, show signs of uh, strong growth, right? And, and as user search volumes continue to grow, it shows an upward trend. Uh, what we've seen is also that the search for grocery and everyday supplies have become very, very location specific. Uh, also searches such as food delivery, cake delivery, et cetera, continue to grow with more and more people ordering food at home uh, and online, right? And, and more and more celebrations now happening at home only. So I think this is one of the major trends that, is, that, that has uh, you know, shown signs of stronger growth. Also branded searches for most of the brands, uh, brands out there, right? In the market, such as Big Basket, uh, Nature's Basket, DMART, Grofers, etc. All of them are seeing the phenomenal growth, uh, which is also being leveraged by these brands as they improve their uh, brand presence and grow their penetration in the market. I think on the personal health and well-being front, uh, these these queries are seeing a huge spike, uh, with more and more people now becoming aware of their health. Uh, there is also, I think, a need among people to work towards improving both their physical and mental well-being. People are increasingly opting for online consultations and are seeking nutritional guidance. Immunity and diet related searches have seen almost 125% increase, uh, you know, over the year. Also as gym fitness centers remain shut, uh, we are seeing an increase in search queries for people inquiring and opting for virtual sessions, 
to stay fit at home there are also increasing investments that people are making in gym equipment and setting gym at homes so these are pretty interesting trends and and continue to show strong trajectory uh, also i think since people are now staying at home in isolation as they deal with crisis and personal losses as well right a lot of people are also facing mental health issues like stress anxiety depression anger fear right and and we are seeing there is a huge uh, increase in queries for support resources and seeking help online talking about uh, the entertainment and music vertical we have seen generic searches across the vertical hit an all time high uh, top queries or user searches that have stood out uh, like anything are our searches like you know popular netflix series new tv premieres cricket live scores etc and this is again a vertical that is going to show a signs of significant growth in future as well i think on the subscription related searches there is almost a 24x jump in terms of you know searches for almost all platforms such as netflix savan gana prime video hotstar etc so i think people are opting for a lot of online content streaming services at home gaming has emerged as a very very strong vertical during the last 12 to 18 months online games are on the rise and as internet devices and users keep increasing this is another vertical that is going to show significant um, you know upside as we uh, move into the future quarters we have also seen a great spike in automobile as a vertical uh, due to lockdown restrictions consumers are avoiding visiting vehicle dealer dealership showrooms right and which is also increased affinity towards online channels when they research about their next purchase in the automobile sector uh, preferences towards personal vehicles have increased as people have chosen to stay away from public transport for safety purposes so we've seen a, a spike in all types of searches for vehicles right whether it's four wheelers or two wheelers everything has gone up vehicle insurance related services uh, searches have almost shot up by 10 times from the time even when lockdown was lifted so so this is again uh, you know another interesting vertical that is showing signs of um, a significant online user growth there is a lot of traction that we are seeing in terms of users exploring personal finance and investments a lot of people are now prioritizing health insurance to protect themselves and their loved ones health insurance queries have almost seen a 300x uh, rise on microsoft search also we are seeing a change in investment choices uh, by users and this is a pretty interesting one right the trend also indicates that a lot of users have have had a change in investment preference from owning a physical asset to financial instruments top searches in this vertical are queries such as mutual funds uh such as such as mutual funds asset management stock trading etc there are also a lot of factors such as industry wide adoption of online kyc cheaper and faster transactions liquidity greater control and elimination of middlemen etc right which has helped uh, fasten the shift in behavior and then digital payments continue to grow online learning has seen a huge rise in user searches online learning and education as a category has seen a huge boost overall with learning and education centers schools colleges being shut a number of audiences got used to e-learning methods and this continues to be one of the most sought out categories by the users we have seen searches for uh, preschools k12 education centers etc gain a significant traction uh, on microsoft search people are also now future proofing their careers by learning new skills that would either help them transition to a new career or also progress in the in the existing one so education and e-learning is another category where there is a lot of uh, investment happening in by the users uh, online and then another interesting vertical where we have seen a lot of traction is home improvement this is another category that has seen massive growth during this period and is coming out very strongly for 2021 we have seen major growth across bedroom and living room categories searches such as bedroom furniture living room furniture sofas mattresses have almost seen a 500% growth which clearly highlights the way in which people are also looking and redecorating their houses as this is also their place of comfort and safety while people are focusing on improving their homes they are also investing in home appliances and we have seen almost 40% of the consumers now preferring to buy online even after the lockdown restrictions were over 
which also shows that the comfort level of making online purchases even for high ticket items such as consumer durables has increased significantly during this period so what does this actually mean for brands and different verticals right users are spending a lot more time online brands from different verticals are finding new and innovative ways of interacting with their users also i think the lines between brand marketing and performance marketing now is blurring for marketers and brands right brands are leveraging search advertising for also now driving awareness and we have seen that a lot happening on microsoft search advertising as well we have seen uh, verticals gain massive traction and i think brands can fully leverage this jump by finding new and innovative approaches as they reach out to their users i think there is a huge opportunity for brands to capture the users online and the interesting part would be to see how brands can rise to this challenge so i think i would with that thought leave you all uh, thank you all for joining and feel free to reach out to the marketing team at inmovi for any questions that you might have thank you thank you so much rohit for uh, you know telling us about the report and the insights behind it thank you so much once again for your time thank you